Now, here in the Treasure State, Planned Parenthood, Montana has filed a lawsuit to stop the enforcement of a new law that's about to be signed by Governor Greg Gianforte, arguing that it violates the state's constitution. Ren Wadsworth helps break down the proposed law and litigation. Developing news, Planned Parenthood of Montana is suing the state of Montana, challenging House Bill 721. The organization and its chief medical officer, Dr. Samuel Dickman, filed the lawsuit in Lewis and Clark County recently. The suit challenges House Bill 721, which bans D&E procedures, also known as dilation and evacuation. But Planned Parenthood argues these procedures are the safest and most accessible method for abortion after 15 weeks of pregnancy. The lawsuit argues that the bill violates Montana Constitution, specifically Montanans' right to privacy and access to pre-viability abortions. They believe the matter was already settled with the 2008 U.S. Supreme Court decision of Armstrong versus the state of Montana. House Bill 721 threatens medical providers with a fine of up to $50,000 and 10 years of prison just for performing a medical abortion. The ban would take effect once signed into law by Governor Greg Gianforte, but the suit is asking the court to intervene before the ban takes place. Martha Fuller, president of Planned Parenthood of Montana, released a statement saying in part, quote, providers should be able to use their medical training, judgment, and expertise to provide the care that is best for each patient without political interference or fear of criminal prosecution. President for the Planned Parenthood Federation of America also released a statement about the lawsuit saying in part, quote, House Bill 721 makes patients less safe by placing Montanans health and future in the hands of politicians. She also goes on to say, should this law take effect, thousands of Montanans and people across the region who have already been forced to come to the state for essential abortion care will suffer, end quote. Planned Parenthood of Montana also says Montana is a key access port access point in the region where surrounding states have already banned what they deem an essential health care procedure entirely. And as both the bill and the lawsuit progresses, we will continue to follow them both and keep you updated with any new information. In studio, I'm Ren Wadsworth, Nonstop Local. All right, Ren, thank you very much.